What's up, mate? How's it going? How are we going? Yeah, good. Good to be back with Happy. Yeah, Haven't been a long time, ages, eh? Ages, man. <laughs> Everyone, life gets in the way and we all get busy and stuff, and Happy's got a new job, so I don't get to go riding much anymore, but uh, <laughs> here today it's raining. Um, Happy's rocked up, so we saw we'd have a look at the new W800 uh, cafe. This is awesome, man. Yeah, mate, this is uh, the latest and greatest. They've also got a street model coming out as well, which I just ordered yesterday. Oh, they have two models, do they? Yeah, they've got two models on the W8, the mm -hmm. black edition, yeah. and they've got the cafe, and now they've got a street, street couple, street yeah, something yeah. or other. Um, I should have that next week, so uh, that'll be cool. But hey, we're talking about this one. Very excited about this model. There is updates from last year's model. Uh, they've changed the suspension. Uh, in the standard, in the standard side of things, changes suspension, increased rigidity in the frame. So they've changed. It's thicker, thicker steel used in the frames through here. Also up the back piece through there. It's all thicker steel and so on. Um, 270 mil. Like 270 mil rear disc brake on this one. Uh, last year's had the drum come out with a disc brake on the rear now. Also with ABS. ABS as standard, as per most bikes. Um, fully tuned, tuned exhaust pipes, so you get some nice sound out of that. Traditional styling. There are two pipes. Two pipes, yep, yeah, one, two, which is an 800, 360 degree crank. Um, also comes out with a slipper clutch, clutch assist as standard, uh, to stop that the rear wheel lock and bouncing and so on into corners. Um, uh, what else have we got? What else have we got? Oh, new forks, revised forks, stiffer springs in the forks. I like the the way this one looks, mate. Yeah. It looks so good. Steel guards. Yeah. Now this is a um, from the tradition of the W model that they brought out in 1966. Now back then, the w, Kawasaki's W was the biggest CC Japanese motorcycle on the market uh, with with the W. Um, in 1966, so Kawasaki brought that out to basically to have the fastest bikes, the most powerful bikes from 1966, and they're still doing it today. So it's beautiful. W800. Uh, the bars on this, super cool bars, traditional bars. Uh, still got the traditional gauges on there. The uh, cafe style screen, cafe style, cafe <laughs> screen. It's got the same sleek. light as a Z900 yeah, RS. Yeah, that's six, That's six a beauty. LED light. So good. Low and high beam and so on through there. If you have a look, I don't know if you can see the bulbs in it. They're just like an LED strip in the light. Yeah. Cool looking thing. I don't know where the tires happy. I like the rim. They're not comes with the yeah. alloys. Alloy it's rim. good man, it, I like that. Alloy rim, 320mm disc brake, full floating disc brake on the front. The 18 inch tyres front and rear. Revised forks, stiffer springs, increased rigidity. So this bike here, although it looks similar to the previous W800s from 2011, 12, up to last year, uh, is a revised model, so it is. Uh, there's more, more technology going into it. They've they've stiffened the frame. It's got some sleek styling, tank, the engine, slipper clutch, ABS, all the stuff that that we that we want in a motorcycle. And it's also got a classic, classic 800 cc engine, um, which is a really nice bike to ride. Uh, as far as a bike to ride, it's a really good rider's bike. <laughs> Um, a really good rider's bike, and with that classic styling as well. Um, seat. Pops off through there. All your, your brains of it all, tool kit. I don't know where the battery is. The battery's on this side. In there. Oh yeah. Hear that? Sounds like steel to me. <laughs> all steel. Yeah, it's steel, mate. Built, built the old way. As I, I, I express that, fuel injection. I've been fuel injection for years and so on. Still got that classic look. Now, look at that seat, easy as. As Z900 RS. Oh, the Z900 seat's pretty easy as well. Kawasaki, <laughs> they just made the easiest seats to put on and off. Yeah, look up. <laughs> it's good, right? 
Um, Looks so good. Handles right? there, either for a pillion or for a strap. That's good. On. Yep. You remember I put on Z900 RS mic. What'd you put on? They're still loose. <laughs> Oh yeah. No, not G nine hundred. No, it's M two nine mine. Yeah, What the fuck up my bike name, mate? Yamaha. Who knows? See? <laughs> your, your, your head saying it's a Kawasaki, <laughs> mate, isn't it? Uh, I put the Kawasaki sticker on it. Yeah. <laughs> I got some badges. Yeah. Oh, it's not. It's not PD. That traditional styling in the um. Yeah. The the controls. Nice grip. Feels good. So good, mate. So good. Even like the master cylinders, that old round style. Oh yeah. Old round mirrors. Now have a look at the, the thickness of it. How thin is this bike? It is. It's, 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 it's good all the way, man. Can you jump on it? Trim down. Do you want me to jump? Have a look. Yeah. One thing I noticed that it didn't have was a center stand. That's all right. Yeah, oh, that's fine. That's fine, man. And then the stand when you're sitting still, man. Yeah. Um, but it's actually quite roomy. It's good. It suits yeah. you, mate. It suits the uh, small people and big people, mate. It's, uh, it's good. Yeah, that's fun. I do love riding the, um, the old Z, uh, W800. I think it's Z900 for, for my heart. Is, um, the old W800 is a fun to ride. It's hmm. Such a fun ride. Fun, fun ride. It's good. This is more nimble and more smoother. With uh, tons of power. Tons of power. Tons of power. It's not like, uh, like, tons of like power. what we call that Z900 or RS. Yeah, it's twin. Oh, so it's a 360 degree um, parallel. Yeah, so, it's twin. Um, they are a real <sighs> traditional sort yeah. of artist. I'm, a, I'm really happy with the model. Like It comes like really as previous model. Yeah. Not a big change. Only change they have disc brake for me disc brake. and the ABS on it. ABS easy to work with yeah, and uh, it's the got the so slipper clutch. Slipper clutch easy to work with yeah. and uh, still traditional style oh, fairing on it and the uh, light from the Z900 RS. Yeah. Uh, if the customers want, they can change this. Uh, pumpkin indicator into oh, the right. LED indicators. I reckon they won't melt if we put the RS indicator on it. No, well that would still look pretty cool. Yeah. But, you know, I, I, you want to change all that stuff, great, just get out and ride it. Yeah. Just have a ride of it, like, who cares? It's so good, man. Look, looks like that. I think they look good. That's that old um, dirt bike style KDM looking indicator, isn't it? Yeah, it's so good. Love it. So, yeah. You tuck behind him, look at that. That's... Can you see something? Yeah, on the track? Oh, yeah, I'll oh, see. <laughs> but, um, it's good. Yeah, so the paint, the paint scheme, the colours, I think they all work. Um, yeah, it does match with the fairing, that colour down there. And if somebody wants custom paint, like you always oh, does on do the RS, anyway, yeah. they can do whatever they want, they can tell you. You want to custom paint the KLX 110, we can do that. Course. Yeah, so you good. Know, whatever you want. And this, this bike here, uh, just a smidge over 15,000 Australian dollars, mm -hmm. right away with 12 months dual seat rego. Um, good bike, great bike, great bike. It's good stuff, it's classic, you can chuck this one anywhere, wherever you want. Uh, it work. It's all metal in the bottom. Oh, yeah. It's nothing crazy like breakdown on the way or something. So good, man. It's, I love it. I, I so, love it. W800, 2019, 2020. Yeah. It's 20 coming, man. What year is it? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's 2020. Oh, that's 2019. 1920, 20, yeah, yeah. 1920, yeah. just released. They don't change model every year, not this one. No, well, you know, they've done all the updates on this bike here. We'll get the Sport in next, next week, and the mm. Sport's a demo, so I can ride that. We'll do a ride on that. And so also good. And we've got a used 2015 in too, so we can, we can have a WA100 ride day, mate. Here, mm. right? Yeah, it's beauty, mate. So Alrighty. Good. So good to good see you to back, back, mate. So good. There's more. Coming at you. There you go, Fork is happy here. There's Mick. So we'll catch you guys in the next video. Have fun. Hey, subscribe. Yeah, I got some Aussie Cowie man, he's got some good yeah. stuff too. So. Yeah, he's building his Check own bike. 
uh, the channel name. You guys probably know Ozzy Cabin Man. Have a look. Have a look at that. Yeah, it's look good. Wow. Beauty. What was that model, mate? From building. Oh, well, I'm building a '91 Kawasaki Tangai. 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 Yeah, I'm telling you, do a body paint on it and make it like a, a big brother versus 1000. What do you reckon? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. That's that's happening. Um, make more sub subs on his channel and push him. More Do subs, a, more money, more money. Yeah, yeah more course. money and the good pen on it. It's the only habits I've got. Oh, I can't be here again. Yeah, it's all good. Alrighty, see you guys. Have fun. Take it easy, eh?